one of the perks of owning a brewery. Well, thank you for coming to our website. Um, we are Green Man Brewery, and we'd like to tell you a little bit about our history of our brewery and what we do. We are one of North Carolina's oldest brewery, founded in 1997. Originally as a brew pub in the back of the Jack of the Wood uh, pub, which is just up the street here. Uh, two years ago, in, in 2010, we embarked on an aggressive growth strategy. Then we expanded our brewery and, and started seeking out distribution throughout North Carolina. It's working very well for us to the point where we are now expanding again into a new facility and we're going to have a bigger brew house and hope to get into packaging here in the next couple of years. <laughs> uh, hi, I'm John Stewart. I'm the brewmaster here at Green Man Brewery. Brewing starts with four raw materials, malted barley, water, hops, and yeast. And uh, we start the process by mixing uh, hot water and uh, malted barley together uh, to form a mash. And uh, during that mash, uh, the starches are converted to sugars. Uh, then we capture those sugars by draining them off into the root kettle. The uh, liquid which extracts the sugars from the malt is called wort. And we run the wort off into the kettle and we bring it to a boil. We uh, add hops at that point and boil it uh, for about an hour and a half. And we may add different hops to the kettle at different times, uh, depending upon the individual brew that it is. After the kettle boil, we cool it by pumping it through a heat exchanger, which uh, cools it down to 65, which is the fermentation temperature. And at the same time, we pump it over into a fermentation tank. After that, it's the fermentation stage where the yeast is added. And uh, yeast is uh, alive. It's a unicellular organism that consumes sugars and produces alcohol. And uh, move it over into our packaging tanks. The packaging tanks are under pressure, and that pressure, CO2 pressure, uh, pushes the beer into the cakes. Green Man is known for English style traditional ales and um, definitely experimenting with more aggressive and distinct flavors in some of our bigger wines that we have like the Dweller Imperial Stout and the Rainmaker Double IPA. And our main line is our IPA, ESB, Extra Special Bitter, Porter, and right now our Seasonal Stouts. So thank you again for coming to Green Man's website and I hope you get a chance to try our beer. Cheers.